All right, guys, I just have one question for you. Where would you go for free Tanner Fox wheels? Right now, I'm at 7th Avenue South, Central Park. I'm gonna hide these wheels for you guys. This would be the place to have an electric scooter because you could be keeping up the same speed as all these cars but you would be able to move about more freely since you can still go on the sidewalks. I don't consider myself to be a street rider, but I am riding in the street right now, so maybe maybe that translates, I don't know. <laughs> Yo, let's race. <laughs> all right, once the light turns green, all right? Let's get it. Oh. Sick man. <laughs> yeah. Literally, you can't go two minutes without seeing like a bird scooter or any type of electric scooter. Yo, New York homies, I'm gonna be hiding a set of wheels in Central Park. I'll show you where they're at. The first one to find them gets to keep them, so be on the lookout. All right, here we go. I got the wheels. Right now I'm on South 7th Avenue. I'm gonna go hide them over there. All right. All right, we're just waiting for the stories both to upload. That one's got a little bit more. Sorry, PSA to all my New York homies. If you live near Central Park, you gotta come through. I'm hiding a set of wheels. I'm gonna post about it in the next slide. I'll show you exactly where they are. The first person to come and find them gets them. And also, I'm gonna be chilling here for a little bit, so if you don't need me, uh, we'll be here for the next 30 or 40 minutes. These are absolutely all over the place. Everywhere you go in New York City, you find a taxi. When I actually landed in the airport, I couldn't get an Uber. The only way I could get to my hotel or my Airbnb was by taxi. The weather here does suck though. So it gets you tired and sweaty. Squeeze. It's actually not too bad. My bar width has like 
twice the size on either side of it. Definitely gotta pay attention to every traffic light. And also the ambulances, because they come flying around. So sick though. Being able to do this, you guys can't see right now, but I'm wearing my helmet. I would highly recommend it for you guys as well. Here we go again. Maybe getting a little more narrow. This is like the narrow challenge, bro. Keeping it going. Split the lanes, dude. They're all parked cars, so I'm not too worried about it. But the light just turned green, so we gotta be careful right now. Trail behind this guy. Try not to swerve too much. Keep getting in. Oh, that's a lot. That was crazy. But we're doing it. Again, we're doing it. Getting through it. Trying to get to our destination. Oh, dang, he messed this up. It's all right. Keep going now. Every car is going about like five miles an hour. But you still want to be super careful because as soon as one of these cars splits the lane, they're going to go straight into you. And that is just not good. Look at this. the wheels up I hung out afterwards for about 30 or 40 minutes and I was like thinking to myself it's a school night and I think a lot of people have gone back to school already since summer is coming to a close so there probably won't be anyone that shows up you know within the next 10 minutes so then after that I just dipped so anyway I don't know how long they're gonna last so when this video goes up they may or may not still be there Dude, it is packed with people right now. And cars, and everything. I'm trying to get to the Brooklyn Bridge, and I'm all the way at Times Square. We have a long ways to go. So I'm most likely just gonna be paying attention to my Instagram to see if anybody actually finds those wheels. And if they do, I'll let you know. But if they don't, then at the end of this video, I'm gonna put some text up, you know, as, as the last clip, and I'll put the address on the screen. So that way you can go find them for yourself. Dang, that's pretty cool. I'm gonna take a look and see if anyone actually found those wheels. Oh shoot, look at this. No way. AF Doc Scoots found the wheels. So stoked for you, man. I hope you like them. Look at this. No way, that's so awesome. I threw him some wristbands as well. I'm messaging this guy back right now. I'm so happy for him. Bam, there we go. I'm gonna definitely repost this guy on my story as well. This is so sick. I'm so stoked that another scoot rider found those wheels. I was kind of like thinking, oh, what if like a stranger finds them and they just take them just cause like they're there. But that wasn't the case. This guy named AF Scoots on Instagram found them. I hope he puts them to good use. Thank you so much Lucky Scooters for hooking me up with those Tanner Fox Sig wheels so that way I could give them away to a homie here in New York. All right, that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one.